everyone and welcome to a new lesson on module 7, Helping Out. So let's get started and please get your textbook ready, this one, and we look at page 73. So, untuk korang yang belum tengok video yang sebelum ni, if you haven't watched the previous video, please do watch this video, okay? Link up here, right? Please do watch this video, tolong tengok video ni kalau tak, anda mungkin takkan faham apa yang kita akan belajar hari ni. If you haven't watched the previous video, you might not be able to understand what we're trying to learn today. Okay, so as I said the last time, today's lesson is actually connected or related to the previous lesson, okay? Apa yang kita akan buat hari ni, actually berkaitan dengan apa yang kita pernah belajar sebelum ni. Alright, so first and foremost, I really apologize sebab Mungkin tu sesetengah orang, aktiviti ni agak membosankan. Okay, but I'm sorry sometimes when it comes to grammar lesson, things can be a bit technical. Okay, mungkin bila kita belajar tata bahasa, ada sesetengah topik yang agak technical dan tidak begitu meneronokkan. Alright, okay. So, tak apa yang tu. I try my best to make you guys really understand on what we are trying to learn today. So, before this, we have learned like, I want that book. Pass me that book. She wants that book. Pass her that book. We want some chocolate. Give us some chocolate. Okay, tapi hari ni, lain sikit. So, firstly, please look at your module. Alright, refer to page 73 and match. Okay, that's our first activity. And then kat bawah tu, refer to the activity above, write the correct answer. Okay, so the template and the style of this activity is actually quite similar to the last activity that we've done. Okay, uh, lebih kurang je sama macam activity kita pernah buat sebelum ni. I want you guys to Understand this, right? This is my book. The book is mine. Kita nak cuba cakap benda tu kita punya. Ataupun benda tu dia punya. Ataupun benda tu mereka punya. Okay? So, kalau dalam English kita cakap ownership. Just now, the example. This is my book. The book is mine. Okay, let's think of one more. This is her blouse. The blouse is hers. You can refer to the guides or the notes on page 73 or you can refer to this table right here. Okay, I can just have to get the kat sini. Sorry, I totally forgot about the table. Alright, okay, so you can refer to this. Okay, let's think of another one. That is your pencil. The pencil is yours. Mm. Those are our toys. They are ours. Tapi kadang-kadang, dia ubah sikit dia punya situasi ataupun keadaan. So, sometimes, the situation will be different. Alright? So, what I'm trying to say is, the sentence is going to be a bit longer and it will test you. Ayat tu akan jadi lebih panjang dan dia akan uji kamu. Kamu faham ke tak? Okay, contoh saya bagi ya. Okay, I'm going to give you an example. That is not Adam's laptop. He borrows it from Nina. The laptop is, this is actually sentence number four from activity two. Right? Okay. Not Adam's laptop. Whose laptop is it? Uh, siapa punya laptop tu? So we know that it is not Adam's laptop. Okay? So he borrows it from Nina. Dia pinjam. Okay? Daripada siapa? Uh, Nina, right? Okay, so laptop tu, Nina punya. Okay, so Nina is a girl, so the answer is hers. The laptop is hers. Okay, let's look at one more that might be a bit difficult. My mother gave me that bag yesterday. The bag is now. Okay, so semalam, mak saya bagi satu bag. Okay, ataupun sebuah bag. Bag tu, kepunyaan Sekarang, okay. Siapa punya bag tu sekarang? Okay. Who owns the bag now? Okay. Siapa yang memiliki bag tu sekarang? Ah. 
Of course, mine lah, right? Sebab saya dapat, kan? Uh, so, the answer is, the bag is mine now. Right. Let's look at another one. Okay. I took my rubber from him just now. He borrowed it this morning. The rubber is... Okay, so ni dia nak cakap. Pemadam tu siapa punya? Right. Let's look. Right. I took my rubber from him just now. Okay, saya ambil saya punya pemadam daripada dia tadi. He borrowed it this morning. Okay, dia pinjam pemadam tu pagi tadi. Pemadam tu siapa punya? Of course lah, saya punya. Okay. So, the rubber is mine. Okay. Dia tu pinjam je. Pemadam tu bukan dia punya. Okay, dia hanya meminjam. Uh, Alright, so... That's basically everything you need to know. Okay? Okay. Hope you guys can follow and hope you guys can understand. Alright. By the way, everyone, so if you have any doubts or if you don't understand, okay, katakan kalau awak tak faham, please do comment below. Right? So, say for example, you don't understand about this or you don't understand about that. Okay? At least I know. Which one that you don't understand? Please comment below. Kalau ada yang tak faham ataupun ada yang macam awak ragu-ragu. Okay, so basically the first one, activity one, you match. Okay, sama je macam activity sebelum ni. Okay, then let's look at activity two. Okay, so I've explained about... Actually, I've done three sentences just now. Okay, so now I'm just going to do the ones that are a bit simpler. Right. Maybe I do number two. Those are our pencils. They are okay, our hours. Right, so the answer is hours. Let's try number five. Those are their shoes. They are okay. So there, theirs. Right? So the answer is theirs. Okay, let's try number eight. That is Anna's cat. It's hmm. So Anna. Anna is a girl. Alright, so the answer is hers. That is Maria's drawing. It's hmm, Maria is a girl. So the answer is hers. Okay, let's try one more. Okay, one more. Let's try number nine. They won the car in a contest last year. The car is okay. They won the car in a contest last year. They okay. They refers to their. Okay. And kalau kena nak cakap mereka punya. So, so the answer is theirs. I think it's also important that you should know this like I, my, he, his, she, her, then maybe like, you know, we, our, they, their, I think you should also memorize on those things. So like I've said just now, ada sesetengah benda dalam dunia tetabahasa ni yang agak susah. Okay? There are some things in grammar that can be a bit confusing and quite difficult. Okay? But it's alright. So the more you practice, the more you learn. So I hope you can learn a lot from today's lesson and if you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos, especially more videos on module 7 helping out, do hit the subscribe button. So, in the subscribe button, you'll see a bell logo, okay? I kind of start to log check, ah, right? So, if you want to click on that, you receive notification from me. Uh, so, bila saya upload video baru, once I've uploaded a new video, you'll receive a notification. So everyone, we'll meet again in a new video coming soon. So everyone, thank you so much for spending time with me and thank you so much for watching this video. Alright, so stay home, stay safe and see you again next time. Bye guys!